Hey, hey, what's what's going on here, Dali? Uh huh. Everyone's just being cash. You have tape anywhere? Yep. So all of the offices are named after places in our world. And there's a line in the script describing the place that is currently kind of ubiquitous. Office, which I've printed out. And I'm gonna put it next to- And you chose all the office names, right? Yeah, we chose all the office names. Underneath. Underneath. What are you doing to my room? Nothing. Nothing. Hey everyone, uh, welcome to another vlog from Midgut Games. We just wanted to give you a brief update on what's been going on with us at Midgut and share with you the latest on the development of the game, what's been happening at the studio and all the things that are going on because it's a bit crazy these days. So pretty much since it's August, everybody's coming back from summer vacation. We have had pretty empty days here in the office for some of the days during the summer but uh, now for the first week it seems like most everybody is back in and we are getting our hands back on the game and everything's going back into full swing we have some news unreal engine 5 is in full motion so it's extremely exciting to be working with a new game engine it's a store full of new toys pretty much lumen nanite all the good stuff gameplay ability system as well just a game changer really pun intended so hopefully you know we can maybe maybe not i don't know share something <laughs> from the development of Unreal Engine 5 sometime in the coming months, I'd say. So I've been doing some prototyping in Unreal Engine 5 these past few weeks, months. Time has lost all meaning during COVID and it's been really great. I've been using Nanite a ton and the Quicksort Bridge is just so neat and nice. I have been moving things from the old project and <laughs> have been getting fun bugs, like my cables are lighting up, but that's just I mean, we know it's unstable to start with, and it's just simple things like that. But mostly, it's been so good. Nanite is amazing, Lumen makes everything more beautiful, and I thoroughly enjoy it. 10 out of 10. Would recommend. <laughs> What's going on here? It was a poker. Racing all, everything off it. Table, tablet, whiteboard, whiteboard to put everything out in a scrum fashion, like a list of things we need to do because we're moving a lot of stuff away from the old system of creating our own state components or state machines into gameplay boot systems, which has built-in state machines. So we're breaking the entire project for a month, and then we're gonna rebuild it. Woo! Puzzling. Proper interview. Yeah, we're gonna leave, need a lot of coffee. Beer and gift. We've had pretty substantial updates to the studio. We are upgrading the motion capture studio that we have somewhere over there with new motion capture cameras, adding cameras to the space to cover more area and get better data. We also upgraded our face gear, so the face cameras that are mounted to the actors. We got brand new face wear helmets. So what just arrived? The face wear head cams. Face wear just sent us the most extravagant equipment case I've ever seen. All right, so unboxing, face wear. It's a head cam Mark IV from Facewear and it's the whole shebang. It's the key pro rack, the helmets themselves, and a bunch of. I don't even know what's in here. Bebo Bamicro. Is it batteries? I haven't looked yet. Please don't do any assault and battery. <laughs> Half of the live studio audience has left, but I am still enthralled. Oh, come on, be a live studio audience. So we have another thing. <laughs> <Something like that. laughs> Riffles. Wow. <laughs> it is some sort of switch bar. Let's see what's underneath. A nuclear detonator. Oh shit, it's the camera. It's the actual equipment we need. <laughs> Beautiful. Ooh, it's the, it's the small iPads so we like. That's actually a really cool model. Yeah, we mapped these to our station. Oh, so we can see the performance. Yeah, we see the face performance is live That's now. That's awesome. Yeah. It's makeup remover. Ooh. Paper bags. Can I, can I try out the big <laughs> one? Sir. I'm doing my part. I'm doing my part too. <laughs> yeah, what's your utility belt? This is probably a data package or something. We are a professional. Yeah. We'll probably figure it out. This is so cool. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> we are expanding the studio. As we had to test earlier, we were looking for new people to join us in development. And so far, we have, in our previous video, we introduced uh, Haukon and Ulrich. But over the next six to eight weeks or so, we are actually going to be bringing in five more people, you know, with different nationalities and from different countries and different studios and different backgrounds. So it's super exciting to have them on board. And it's going to be awesome to have finally those positions filled so that, you know, the teams are even more empowered and we have even more awesome people contributing to the game. As a result, we are actually going to be opening up even more positions pretty soon. So we are going to be posting on mishgood.is slash careers, probably next week or the week after that, some more positions. But we are still looking for almost every department. We do look at every single application that comes our way. So, you know, please make sure to apply and also Make sure to include any sort of portfolios that you have, previous work, stuff like that. It really, really, really helps us identify who you are and what you've done and what you know. We've had a tremendous amount of applications so far, and we just want to say that we are doing this as fast as we can, as well as develop the game. But, you know, it usually takes us, you know, at least two to four and even up to six weeks to respond to every application. So even if you don't get the reply instantly, we're sorry. If it's urgent, please just mention so. We might catch that. But other than that, you know, we'll try to get back as soon as we can. Sorry for not being quicker than that. <laughs> So yeah, so that's that's kind of a brief update of everything that's going on. We hope to keep the steady flow of content going. So please just stay tuned to the YouTube channel. Remember to subscribe, hit that bell for notifications when we post new videos. You can also check out our Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn. We try to post everywhere. So just stay tuned. And if you want to reach out, send us an email, you know, direct messages, whatever it may be. And yeah, and stay tuned for the vlogs. I'll see you next time.